St Boswell's Public Hall was built by public subscription and opened in 1895. It has been owned and managed by the village ever since. It's a registered charity and plays a vital role in the life of the community. Because of its large size and its stage, the hall attracts a very wide variety of use by all age groups. There are currently 26 local organisations using the hall on a regular basis. These include the Puppet Theatre, the Babington Club, the Toddlers Group, St Boswell's Community Council, St Boswell's Live, Indoor Tennis, the Concert Band, various martial arts classes, the Pensioners Soup Club, Fitness Classes for the Elderly, Afternoon Games Club and many more. In 2012, with the hall under threat of closure, the village managed to raise £30,000 needed to install a new central heating system, which allowed all of these groups to continue to use the hall. However, being almost 120 years old, the building still has a number of problems which require urgent attention to comply with health and safety regulations and make it fit for purpose in the 21st century. The village is fortunate to have amongst its community a number of professionals in all the relevant disciplines and they have identified the major issues which have to be addressed. The entrance, currently sited directly onto a busy main road, must be resited onto the quieter side road and enlarged to create a proper entrance lobby with disabled access. This will involve removing the interior stair to the band practice room overhead and reciting it outside on the other side of the building. The toilet facilities have to be upgraded and enlarged to provide a proper disabled toilet. At present the nearest one is sited across the road at the bus station. The hall has a very high ceiling with no insulation. It must be insulated to reduce heating costs and lower our carbon footprint. The large double windows need replacing with double glazing for the same reason. And the entire hall lighting needs replacing with modern energy saving light bulbs. The whole hall is also in need of a complete redecoration and the stage needs proper theatrical lighting and a new PA system. All of this costs a lot of money, around £430,000.